And now to the coronavirus pandemic. The vaccine rollout is moving forward in South Florida with the new federal walk-up site at Miami-Dade College's North Campus. But some people are being turned away because they don't have the proper paperwork. CBS 4's Brooke Schaefer is live in Northwest Miami-Dade to explain, Brooke. Hey, Maribel. Yeah, there's been some confusion out here about this specific medical exemption form that you need to have signed by your doctor. There is a specific form now from the Florida Department of Health that you need to have. A doctor's note will no longer suffice here at this Miami-Dade College campus. You can see the line here. It's been pretty steady so far. Unfortunately, though, some people have been turned away, though, because they did not have that right paperwork. Around 6 a.m. Thursday, this was the line of cars at Miami-Dade College's North Campus. An early start for people eager to get their COVID-19 vaccine at the new FEMA-funded state-run vaccination site. As of 11 a.m. on Thursday, 766 vaccines have been administered so far. But the busy day two also came with some confusion. Some people were turned away from getting their shot because they didn't have the right medical form. People have come with medical records, with notes, with other things. Um, just showing up with your medical records saying you need the vaccine. We cannot service you because we don't have the capability here to do a physical, physical exam and assessment. The site is a walk-up site and you don't need an appointment, but it's only for anyone 65 and older, firefighters and police officers 50 and up. As of Thursday morning, all teachers are now allowed to get vaccinated and anyone 18 and older with a medical condition and this specific form from the Florida Department of Health signed by a doctor. You know, anytime we introduce a new procedure at any of the sites, certainly there are going to be a few hiccups. Uh, we regret if anybody was turned away. Even with some morning hiccups, plenty of people were able to get their coronavirus vaccines at the site in Northwest Dade. I got Johnson & Johnson. Along with the almost 3,000 shots that will be available daily at the Miami-Dade College site, there are also two smaller FEMA-funded clinics with about 500 shots a day each. This one in Sweetwater at 250 South West 114th Avenue and another in Florida City at 650 Northwest 5th Avenue. Same deal, no appointments needed and you can just walk up. But again, this is only for people eligible to get the vaccine right now. Back here at Miami-Dade College, you can take a look at the line right now here at lunchtime. It's been pretty smooth sailing for some people, though. We've had a couple of people actually just come out here, tell us it only took them a few minutes. A lot of relief here in Northwest Dade. But I want to also mention that new information within the last hour. Again, the governor confirming all teachers across the state, regardless of age, can get vaccinated. So if you're a teacher, 18 and older, you can come here to get vaccinated now. As far as that medical exemption form that you need to have, we have it posted for you on our website, cbsmiami.com. I'm live in Northwest Aid, Brooke Schaefer, CBS4 News.